on the wrong music. Ah. Okay. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Pilates. So today we are going to be using light weights. So I have three pounds. I have one five pound weight with me for when we get to some of those glute rotations. Um, if you're able to, you can use a heavier weight. I wouldn't say anything more than five pounds. Um, and for your arms, one, two, three at the most. Um, you don't want to overwork the shoulders. Um, we do want, obviously everybody wants beautiful shoulders, um, but overworking them causes trouble in the upper trapezius and the back of the neck. Um, so, we are going to get started oh, on our backs. We're going to lengthen those legs out nice and long away from the body. And just come down onto your backs. Lengthening out the whole body. What is going on? Sorry, I'm having music issues. There we go. Okay. Lengthen out the whole body. Walk those legs out away from you. I want you to take your thumbs for a second and I want you to find your hip flexors. And I want you to push down and away. So you're making this sweeping motion with the hip flexors. We're gonna tell them right now that they're not doing the work today. So press them down and away. And they're right at the front of your hip. All right, take those hands, put them on your hips. Your elbows are about two inches off the ground. You should feel the space in between your shoulder blades. Lengthen those legs out, roll them in towards each other. Find your breath, find that space in the back, nice long neck. Breathing in, holding that tummy nice and tight, engage those muscles all the way around. Take an inhale with the exhale, walk one foot up. Inhale, exhale, second foot in. Make sure that spine is nice and neutral, neutral pelvis, elbows still off the ground. Little tilt in that pelvis, tilt and release. Tilt and release. That's it. So drawing, like you're drawing that belt back across the belly to make that pelvis tilt and release, tilt and release. Exhale and inhale, three more. Good. We're gonna inhale that right leg up and bring it back down. Exhale, steadying out. So really thinking about pushing the foot that's on the floor down. That's your standing leg. Inhale one and exhale the other. Keeping the distance between the hips and the ribs. Nice and steady. You can even put your fingers on your hips and your thumb on your lower ribs to make sure. Four. And three. Two. And one. Nice job. Inhale those arms up long. Take an inhale as you exhale. Float one leg to table. Inhale. Exhale, second leg to table, hold it right here. Lengthen that spine. We take right arm back and draw it up. Left arm back and draw it up. Here we go, reach and draw it up. Holding that core nice and steady. That's it, you've got it. 
shoulders down away from those ears. So space in that neck, nice and long. For four, three, two, exhale. Nice job. Press those weights down, scooping all of that belly. 
and bring it back. Scoop and hollow. Exhale. Inhale, arms over shoulders. Exhale, scoop and hollow. Inhale, arms up. Keep that upper trapezius relaxed. Good. Four more. Four. Right 
in your lap, in between your legs and your tummy. Scoop and hollow, roll it. Bring it up, find that balance, up nice and tall. Scoop and hollow. And bring it up. Good. Use that tummy. Try not to use momentum here. That's it. Use as much as you need. Really trying to control that roll. Good. Three more. Find that length in the spine at the top. Right through the crown of the head. Two. And one more. Nice job. Okay, take that weight out. We're going to hold on to that right knee as we come back. Reach, single leg, stretch. Left leg, single leg, stretch. Lengthen the front of those hip flexors out. Here we go. Reach. And reach. And reach. And reach. Good. Lengthen those legs. Find that precision in the movement. Inhale and exhale. Don't forget your breath. We're going to connect it all together. Nice job. Good. Eight more. Eight. Seven. Reach. Six.
Good. Bring those knees in. Arms out to a T. We're going to take those legs. You can take them to table. Right here. We're starting into those obliques. So letting the legs come down to the side. Use that oblique to bring them back up to center. Exhale to the other side. Keep that shoulder glued to the mat. And back to center. Exhale. Bring it to the side. Inhale up to center. Exhale side. Pressing those shoulders down in your back. Keeping that pelvis nice and neutral. Getting some rotation in the spine. Good, you've got it. Exhale. Inhale, center. Four. Three. Only going as far as you can control. Two. Last one. Nice job. Draw those knees in. Rock and roll it up to seated. Lengthen those legs out in front of you. Corners of your mat. Flex long through the legs, through those heels, and we'll take those arms out. Inhale out to the side. Exhale, rotate. We saw that toe off. One, two, three. Inhale back to center. Exhale, rotate. Saw it off. One, reach that back arm long. Two, three. Inhale, center. Exhale, rotate. Reach it. One, two, three. Inhale, center. Exhale, rotate. One, two, three. Good. Exhale, rotate. Go. One, two, three. Inhale, center. Good. Exhale, rotate. Saw it off. One. That's it. Nice wide open chest. Two. Three. One more. Nice job. You've got it. So I have one, two, and three. Inhale back to center. Exhale. Let those arms come down. Nice job. Walk those legs back together. We're going to scoop and hollow. Bring it down onto the back. Legs are coming up and over. As we take that roll over, head tight, flex the feet, exhale, scoop and hollow, roll it down, inhale those legs away. If this is too much, keep those legs to the ceiling. Use that lower belly, just a little pelvic lift here if you need to. If you can take that roll over, go for it, inhale down, exhale up and over, lift that tight. Flex the feet. Keep the hips high as if they were on strings. As you roll it down. Point the toes, lengthen away. That's it. Good. Draw up. That's it. Nice job. Okay. You've got it. Inhale away. Exhale, scoop and hollow. Press through those triceps. Up and over. Flex and roll it down gently. Good. Inhale and then exhale. Up and over. Flex. Keep those hips high. And roll it down. One more here. Ah. You should feel a nice long stretch through the sacrum. As you keep those hips high and roll down, stretches out that back. Roll. Nice job. Bring those legs all the way down to the ground. I want you to grab your light weights. 
in those hands, arms out to a T. We're gonna walk the left foot in, foot flat on the floor. So taking a half teaser, we have the weights here. So options for your arms are to scoop up and bring it back down. Or if you wanna take them up overhead and press to that teaser here, you can do that as well. So exhale, find that half teaser, lengthen the spine, inhale back. Exhale, and inhale. Exhale, make sure that tummy's doing the work and it's not just your back. Inhale down. If the leg gets to be too much, you can leave it on the ground and take the upper body right here. You've got it. Three more on the side. Good. For two. And one. Nice job. Take it down. Switch those feet out. So right leg in, left leg long, keep lengthening through that leg. And we're gonna exhale, find that half teaser. Inhale back. Exhale, draw it up. Good, inhale back. Keep the ribs closed when you inhale back. Make sure that we have steady stomach muscles at the top. That's a nice job, you've got it. That's it, good. You've got four. Three. For two. Nice job. One. Good. Bring it down. Draw that leg in. We're going to lengthen those legs out. Inhale the arms overhead. Exhale, take it up and over onto that side. You can drop the weight that's in the bottom arm. We're not going to need it right now. So lengthen out nice and long. That top weight is in that top, is in the arm that's free, off the floor. We're gonna inhale overhead. Exhale, press into that oblique. Good. Inhale overhead. Exhale, press into that oblique. Inhale back. Exhale, press. Inhale back. Exhale, press. Good. Four more here. Four. Three. Two. And one. Good. Hold it right here. Take that top leg up and down. Seven. Six, keep lengthening out. Five. Four. You should feel that oblique working hard. Three. Two. And one. Nice job, bring it down. Okay, option here is to take that weight Right on the outside of that glute, we're going to point it up, flex it down. So it just adds a little bit of extra. Reach and flex. Good. Reach and flex. Keep holding that tummy nice and strong. Nice long spine. One hip on top of the other. You've got four more here. 
four, lift and lengthen. Three. Don't forget about that bottom leg, it's still working two. And one. Nice job, take it up. Hold it here. We take it front, you can flex the foot. And back, back, front, front. Small movements here, front, front. Back, nice job, you've got it. Hold that center nice and strong. Back, back, good, four. Three. Four, two. One more. Nice job. Draw that leg center. Feet together. Draw those knees up. Feet are coming down to the floor. Heels underneath that sit bone. We're going to lift and lower. Keep it nice and parallel. Make sure you haven't lost that waist. Keep trying to pull it up away from the floor. Keeping the ribs and the hip in line. That's it. Shoulders are nice and open, chest is open. Good, four more. Three. Two. One. Good, feet together. Rotate and close. Rotate. It's not gonna go far because that foot is on the floor. You don't have the openness of the other hip. So just getting as much rotation as you can right here. That's it. Nice job. Good, eight. Seven. Nice. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, and one. Good job. Feet off the ground. Full rotation. That's it. Remember, if it starts to get sore, you can drop the weight. Don't overdo. You want to be able to walk tomorrow. And when your body's calling for a rest, it means that fascia needs a break. You got your last eight here, eight, seven, six, five, nice job, four, three, two, and one, nice job, lengthen those legs out. Good, we're gonna come over onto your hands and knees. Find that nice long line. That weight is still in that same hand. We're gonna reach it long and bring it in. You should feel that opposite side activate to hold you nice and strong, right in the side. So reach and down. Good. Reach and down. Good, four more. Four and down. Feel that shoulder blade roll. Three. For two. And one. Nice job. Take that weight. It's going behind that knee. Find that long table. Here's your little test. We're going to take that leg to the side. Hold that weight and 
bring it in. So activate that hamstring. Actively hold that weight. Lift and rotate. Bring it down. Eight more. Keep that belly drawing up. Nice long spine here. Seven. And down. Okay, six. And five. Hold that other side. Nice and steady so it's not shifting at all. Four. So this stays strong and down. You've got it. Three. That's it. Two more. Two. Last one. Good job. Bring it down. Take that weight out. Whew. Give it a wiggle. Shake it out. Let's take it to the other side. So, coming down. Find that nice long line. Lengthen those legs out, waist up away from the floor. Tummy's working hard here. We've got that weight in the top hand. We're gonna take it over and press. Good. Up and over, press. That's it. Good, find that oblique. Press. Good. Keep those shoulders down away from the ears. Four more, four.
You've got it. Four more here, four. Good, three, keep lengthening the sides of the body. Two. And one. Feet together, we rotate, open. And again, those feet are on the floor. You don't have the other hip to rotate with, so it's gonna be smaller than normal. That's it, you've got it. Good. Find those rotators, four more. Four. And three. Two. And one. Good, take those feet up off the floor, heels underneath those sit bones. Full rotation, open and close. Good, that's it, keep using that tummy. Hold that body nice and strong. Good, you've got it, last eight here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, for two, and one, nice job. Bring it down, lengthen those legs out for a minute. We're gonna take it up onto all fours. That weight is still in that hand. Knees underneath the hips, wrists underneath the shoulders. Draw that belly up, press the shoulders down the back. Here we go. We lift and lower. Lift and lower. Good. Six more. Lift and lower. And five. And lower. Four. Weights in hand. 
We're gonna take the weights to the chest. And you again, you can use just one weight here. Scoop it all and roll it down. So this puts a little extra weight on that neck pull. Exhale, keep that weight to the chest, just as if you would have the hands behind the head here. Flex it up and over. Inhale, up top. If you wanna do the two weights, right here, exhale, scoop and roll it down. Still rolling through each vertebrae. Inhale at the bottom. Exhale, keep lengthening those legs out to help get you up and over. Good. Inhale, up tall. Exhale, scoop and all, roll it down. Inhale, back. Of course, you have the options of doing this without the weights, or you can take a regular roll up here as well, right here with the weights or without. Inhale back, exhale, scoop and hollow, roll it up, flex it up and over. Good, two more. Use that tummy. Exhale, flex. One more here. Good, flex up and over. Inhale up nice and tall. Nice job, go ahead and get rid of those weights. We're gonna slide the hands back behind you as if those hands are on eggshells. So fingertips and the heels of the hands on the ground. Nice and tall, open that chest up. We're gonna lift that leg and lower, lift. Lengthen those legs out away from the hips to help them lift. As soon as you start to really straighten and lengthen that leg, it lifts a lot easier. It connects right in with that lower belly. Good, exhale, reach. Inhale down, you've got it. Exhale, reach. Inhale down. Good, four more here, four. And three. Two. And one. Good, we're gonna walk the feet in right here. Still hands behind you, nice and easy. Press up, find that reverse table. Hold it right here, press those arms down. So we're really activating the triceps and the shoulders, chest is nice and wide. And we're gonna march those feet, march, down, march, down, march, down. Good, keep the hips neutral. March and down, you've got it. Good. Four more, come on, you can do it. Four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Sit those hips down. Ah, roll the wrists out. Good, bring it down onto your back. You can take your weights with you. I'm gonna place them on the front of the hips. Taking that bridge, we press up, roll up, and roll down. Again, controlling with that belly. I will give you two options for your legs here. You can keep them at hip distance or walk them together and really squeeze those inner thighs. It's a different bridge holding those knees together at the top so that you're really working the inner thigh right up into the pelvic floor, lower core, and down roll. 
time. Rolling up. And rolling down. Two more. And down. One more. Good. Roll it down. Arms up overhead. Lengthen those legs out nice and long. We're going to take teaser. So you can drop the weights or you can go to half teaser like we did before. You can even place that foot down again. So exhale. Find that teaser. Inhale down. Exhale. Roll it up, lengthen. And roll it down. Good. That's it. And roll it down. You can take those legs to table if having them stretch is too much. Draw right here. And inhale down. Three more. Three. And down. Good. For two. Last one here. Good. And bring it down. Take those weights to the side. Arms down. Legs up. Right to the ceiling. So, options here to take it up and over. Find that rotation. Corkscrew and roll it back down. Inhale up and over, corkscrew, and roll it down. If this is too much, stay on the ground and just focus on rotating the hips from side to side, finding those obliques. So here we go, inhale away. Lengthen even more, exhale up and over, Find that rotation. Hips inside the shoulders. Exhale. Roll it down. Find center. Inhale those legs away. Exhale. Hips high. Use those arms. Press down. Rotate the hips. Keep them high. As you roll down, somebody's got you by your toes. Inhale away. Exhale. Rotate and roll it down. Good. Inhale away. Exhale up and over. Corkscrew and roll. Good. One more. Inhale away. Good. Exhale up and over. Rotate those hips. And roll it down. Good. Take those knees in. Exhale, rock and roll up to a seated position. We're going to take open leg rocker. So lengthening those legs up, taking hold where you can. If open leg rocker isn't in your practice, go right back to rolling like a ball. Scoop and hollow right here. And lengthen up, if you can take, <coughs> excuse me, open leg rock, our legs are right here. Lengthen up through that spine, exhale, scoop and hollow, inhale up, good, exhale, scoop and hollow, and inhale up, exhale, scoop and hollow. And inhale, up. That's it. Good. The more you can lengthen up, the easier this becomes. So really reach through the crown of the head. You've got it. One more. Bring those legs together. 
Good, hold it right here. Find your balance. Can you let go and find it? Good, and bring it down. Nice job. Okay, take it down onto your back. Draw those knees in. We're gonna rotate those legs over. Keep legs to the right. Keep that left shoulder on the ground. Stretch out that oblique, the glute. Feel free to stretch that top leg if you'd like. Good, and bring it up through center. Take it up and over to the other side. Stretch out that back and hip. Good, draw those knees to center and lengthen them out. We're gonna come onto our belly for a nice stretch in the chest. So open those arms to a T and I'm gonna show you what the back looks like so you have an idea. I'm gonna roll onto my shoulder and just walk my hand to where I feel a stretch in the chest. It can roll back as far as I want you can even place that foot down to help you, but it gives you a nice big stretch across the chest and the front of the shoulder. Good, and take it to the other side. Stretch that other arm out. Roll onto it. Leave that arm long behind. Make sure that shoulder stays down away from the ear. Fine, you can walk that arm up or down wherever you feel it. Everybody feels it differently. Good, breathe. Good, come back onto your belly. Shift it back. Come into child's pose. Reach those arms out. So extended child's pose. Really walk those arms out as far as you can, shoulders down away from the ears. Nice deep breath, stretch out under the arms, stretch out shoulders, that's it. Take a nice deep breath in and exhale out. One more, breathe it in and exhale out. Thank you guys so much. I hope you have a fabulous rest of your day. <laughs> Bye.